the time of fellowship with God and prayer. Now, I'm telling you, sometimes, I mean, if we're going to pray some wives for healing, hey, we're going to pray. Uh, when someone says, hey, pray for me, come over here. Let's pray. But boy, I mean, I said, you, don't, you don't just just say, tell me that, hey, pray for me, and walk away. Uh-uh. It ain't happening. You know, when you ask me to pray, I say, okay, come here. Come here. Well, we're in a restaurant. I don't care where we're at. You know, I've, I've been out there at the, at the polls uh, holding signs, waving signs for campaign. Someone says, hey, Bobby, will you pray? I said, the sign down, let's pray. <laughs> what? I, I said, yeah. And then sometimes they're laying in the ground there. I'm like, I'm like, I'm <laughs> so Jesus shows up, touches the life. Amen. It's, it's just what we do. It's prayer. You know, I found a way of talking to my Savior. I found a way of talking to him. And that's what it's about. You know, it's and, and then it's a witness to what what happens. Amen. When someone's healed and someone's such and someone's done, you know, we were praying aloud for it. And guess what? Some other one there said, well, what happened? Well, oh, yeah. Well, he's alive and well. He's real. This ain't no, you know, this ain't this book right here. Man, when you when you pray, and you, the promises he has for you, and you pray them, and they happen. It's real. It's God. It's moving. It's touching. It's changing your life. It's what we do. Glory. Amen. Before we go, go ahead. First one. This then is how you should pray. Amen. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. And forgive us our debts as we also have forgiven our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. Amen. That's how Jesus told us. He said, this is how you pray. Amen. Amen. This is how you pray. Believe me. When you don't know, if you're not just talking to him, but this, this prayer is so powerful in our lives because it does a number of things when you pray that prayer. Yes. First of all, you recognize him as your father. Yes. Yes. Amen. You recognize him as your father. You recognize that the forgiveness that comes by forgiving others. And that's what he does. He keeps the evil one away. You know, there's so many things that that scripture brings that is so powerful. But it said also that scripture is a praying when you pray, you just pray in, in, your, in your spirit or you're praying to him and uh, talking to him. Because, see, there's no special prayer. He just talked to him. Amen. You know, I'll never forget. I told him the first time. I, I went to this time. <laughs> this big council meeting. I was supposed to be with this time. And there's about a thousand men there. <coughs> a thousand. There was a men's retreat in uh, mm -hmm. Leesburg. And so I went up there and I was born. Because I would always do this. Say, Lord, why am I here? Why am I here? I'm saying, and I said, I got you. So I sit under a tree, and I'm right here listening, and I'm going, I don't know none of these people, you know. And uh, he said, relax. So I just sit under a tree, and I'm praying and I'm praying. And so anyhow, he, all these men come together, and there's about 20 guys. And all these pastors, here I am with them cowboy shirt on and blue jeans and you know they tell me come like that I said if they're supposed to dress don't come like you feel like well it was outside Mid Street the heritage guys come up in that room and they all got suits on and there's a couple of them got jeans on and I'm, I'm going okay so I said well they didn't know who I was I didn't know who they were they had doctors and this and that and all the things behind their names. 
one of the names and I said, okay, Lord, why am I here? <laughs> you know, and uh, so anyhow, he, uh, the guy said, okay, he said, we're going to pray for the outreach tonight. He said, if you don't have anything, just say pass. So, man, I guess they were all timing ourselves five or ten minutes into prayers. And there's 20 guys, so guess what? We were there for a long time praying. <laughs> well, when it, I, I don't know what to say because I thought they had said all. So I, when it came to me, I said, pass. <laughs> oh, they looked at me like, what? <laughs> you know, I, I said, pass. Because, I mean, we, I could, there were so many things that they prayed for. I didn't know, and then they did it in King James Version also. You know, there were some of them. So I didn't know all about that, so I asked and said, because I'm just used to talking to him, you know, because my prayer, I just, I tell him what I want, tell him what we're going to, you know, ask him what to do, or find out what's happening, that's what I do, because that's what I need to know, what are we doing, God, why are we here, 